This is an America's Transportation Awards 2014 Top 10 Project Profile. The opening of the Grand Parkway Segment E is a wonderful time for us to stop and celebrate success. All the vision, the leadership, connecting the dots, uh, we're not here by accident. There have always been certain people who drive things. Sometimes uh, they're criticized, but in fact, people like Bob Lanier and Ned Holmes from the private sector uh, driving these kind of things, the Mishers, the Mossbackers. Uh, contribute mightily to everybody in the community. The Grand Parkway is a long story. It started in the 1960s um, with some planners putting lines on paper. It really got started uh, in the late 80s, mid 80s, uh, when Walter Misher, Sr. and Jr. were developing Cinco Ranch and Bob Lanier was chairman of the Highway Commission. And we shared this vision. We thought it was really good for the city. We had to fight for it several times. Where is the money going to come from? How are you going to raise it? Uh, can you find the right contractor to go build this? And there have been, again, environmental issues. There have been political issues, communities that have fought the project along the way. So the concept was, was developed that, in a general sense, everybody knew where the Grand Parkway was going to go, but the specific route it would follow would be determined by who was willing to donate some right away. So the combination of that plus having an ability to donate it and get it back if it wasn't used uh, was really, that, that was the guts behind the Grand Parkway. When I became county judge, that's where it came full circle. Suddenly the first legislative session in 07, there was a, a, a bill giving rights to develop certain highways to the county. This was one of them. So the county took control of the Grand Parkway. And so I got with Judge Emmett, who was very supportive of the Grand Park the way being done, but not by Harris County. And so an overall agreement was put together between TxDOT and Harris County. And so it was kind of a grand bargain uh, that really uh, is working. I mean, it's really working. What's tremendous about the Grand Park was you have seven counties that have come together and said, this is a great example of where we want to go as a region. The timing of the Grand Parkway couldn't be more profound. That's because our region is growing at a dynamic rate, unprecedented in the history of this state. This new outer loop, as new people are coming into our state and it's growing, allows us to get in front of the kind of growth which we very rarely have a chance to do. It's amazing what you can do if you have a motive. Motive being North American campus for ExxonMobil. There's every good reason to believe that we would not have the beautiful Exxon campus without the Grand Parkway. What I really want the community to understand is that major infrastructure projects are very difficult, they're very contentious, but if we don't move forward as a community to provide the infrastructure that we need, this community will be in trouble. I uh, recall the conversations about the 610 loop coming through and dividing the city of Bel Air and the controversy that that caused. Today we can't imagine the city without the 610 loop. They will, they'll, they'll take it for granted. 50 years from now it will be the 610 loop, it will be I-45. Well, let's say, well, where's the next one? I mean, well, let's go another five miles out and start another one. 50 years in the future, uh, Texas will continue to grow. We'll probably double our size and population we are today to more than 50 million people. And so we have to be able to address that mobility. And this is a positive step in solving these congestion challenges for the future. Well, it makes me feel great and honored to be part of that group that did it. I don't look, you can't do these things by yourself. The ship is a reflection of that. You got to bring people together. The secret to Grand Parkway is that we had visionary leaders half a century ago that were willing to put a big idea on paper and stand by that idea. And so today we celebrate Segment E, we celebrate Grand Parkway, knowing that our community is richer and better for it and the future is bright because of the Grand Parkway.
find out more about the competition at americastransportationawards.org.